Captain Coder here, and in this guide, we will be looking at how to fix a collision issue with 2D tile maps in which our player occasionally gets stuck on the platforms while moving. This is the eighth video in our 2D platformer project, and if you missed some of the previous videos, you can find a link to them in the description below, or you can hop right into this part using the provided Unity package. And if you would like to be notified when the next video is out, be sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. Before we hop in, I want to remind you that you can ask your questions, share your projects, and join the Captain's Crew on Discord, or catch me live at CaptainCoder.Live, where I create fun projects like this, chat with the crew, and drink way too much bean water. All right, let's hop in. Here I am, I'm running my game. We can run back and forth, we can jump, but sometimes, it feels like my character is getting stuck when it's moving back and forth. And this is the lip, so right now I'm holding out, here just happened. I'm holding down my right movement and I'm stuck right here and I don't know why. I'm trying to figure out what's going on here and if I pull my game view off to the side, so you can actually pull these out and dock them. I've set up a scene here to help us demonstrate this bug so we can watch a little bit longer view. Let me do it again. Let me see if I can get the bug. There I am. I'm holding down my left movement. I should be moving to the left, but I'm not. If I come in here and I check out my platforms, let's figure out what's going on. If I check out my platforms, we will notice that my character is lining up exactly with my grid here. Our character, it has a box collider, and this box collider is actually intersecting exactly. The corner here is getting stuck on the grid. And this is because our tile map collider actually puts a little square collider around each tile. There are several different ways we could solve this. One of the things I actually love about programming is that there's more than one way to do most problems. In our case, the solution we're going to use today involves making this one big collider. So we won't have a lip to catch ourselves on. We can do this using a composite collider. Notice here in my tile map collider 2D, there is this option used by composite. We're going to start by clicking used by composite and then we want to add in a composite collider notice when i check this box we get an error saying that we need to have a composite collider 2d that's attached to a rigid body composite collider 2d here and the composite collider will actually make it so we have one big collider around each contiguous piece if we run this, we're going to run into trouble here. We've attached a rigid body. Before I hit run, pause the video. What do you think is going to happen? Don't hit run yet. What do you think is going to happen when I run this? All right, and we're back. When I run it, because we have a rigid body, we are affected by gravity. Check it out, our grid falls. That's not what we want. We don't want that to happen. One way we can fix this is by switching to a kinematic body type. Switch to kinematic. Now we won't be affected by gravity. We won't be affected by gravity. Check this out now. Here I am, my game's running. We have one big collider around our platforms if we make multiple platforms those will each get their own and now no matter how hard i try i cannot get stuck onto this platform now it's your turn go ahead add in a composite collider 2d attach it to your tile map collider 2d and then adjust your rigid body such that it is not affected by gravity I want to thank you so much for watching and I hope you found this guide useful. Unfortunately, we still need to fix one more unintended feature before we can move forward. Can you spot it? Hit play mode, search for it, then post it in the comments below. And if you'd like to be notified when the next video is out and see how I approach this deficiency, be sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And as always, keep coding, keep growing, be the best you you can be, and you are welcome back anytime. Bye bye